Hi, this is Tommy Hall with MathDuck.com and I'm here to give a quick overview on how to play left turn auto even and odd. This is the even and odd math version of left turn auto. We also have a rounding math version of left turn auto as well as a regular version left turn auto which you can play on our website for free. You can also download it for your Apple uh, devices, your phones and tablets for free or if you have Android you can also download it for your Android devices for free. When you first start the game, this is the menu you'll see. In the math version, you don't have the option to play the two-player version, and it tells you that right here. Um, but it shows you also, but it does have the links to where you can get it for your Apple devices or for your Android devices. You just click one of these buttons; it'll take you to the store where you can download it for free. Same thing with white one-shot mode; it's not available for the math versions, and it has the links to uh, download it. If you play the logic, just a regular left turn auto, which is a logic puzzle arcade game. Very plays very similar to the math version, but it just doesn't have any math involved in it. It has a two player version, which is a lot of fun. It's uh, where you can play uh, pass to play with two players and you compete against your opponent and uh, you actually try to meet your objectives. Uh, one player does and then he, he goes as far as he can Then when he's through he passes it to his friend or opponent and then when he's through they pass it back and forth a couple of times and at the very end it tells uh, who did the best and who the winner is so that's a lot of fun if you've got two players and one device the one shot mode is single player and it's basically where you see how many levels you can complete with one life and then at that point if you'd like you can get a high score you can put yourself on the leaderboard the options will allow you to turn the music volume up and down or all the way off same thing on the sound effects okay let's go ahead and take a look at the game we're going to go ahead and click the regular button there choose a difficulty uh, selection and you've got choice of easy, medium, and hard. And really the only difference is the speed at which auto travels. And it, as he goes faster, it makes it a little bit more difficult. Uh, but right now, it's on easy. let's go ahead and play the easy level, which isn't too bad. Now, I've played a couple of levels, completed a couple of levels. Actually, I, from looking here at the screen, I know that I've completed the first three levels. And I, I can play the fourth level. And once I complete the fourth level, then the next level will open up for me. And... Uh, but when you first start out, you'll only have the level one available. And let's go ahead and take a look at the. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look at the first level. Here's the instructions. I'm not going to go over that since I'm going to show you how to play. But I do want to show you the board here. And in this, on the first level, it's telling me I need to collect odd numbers, and it's telling me the level number there, level one. If I click this pause button, it will take me to the. Uh, uh, options screen that you saw earlier it allowed me to turn the volume up and down this on both the music and the sound effects it'll also allow me to resume the game or go on to the main menu this uh, portion down here is showing auto x5 or auto times 5 and that means I have five lives here and this is the uh, bar you need to fill up to complete a level and as I get odd numbers on this particular level I do need to get odd numbers so as I get those numbers it'll start filling up and when I get totally fill it up I'll, I'll have completed the level and be able to I'll unlock the next level and be able to play that level so here's auto you control them by clicking the mouse and when you click it once it'll go left click it again it goes left again so that's how you get around the screen you'll be able to see that as, you, as my mouse clicks will show up on the screen but uh, right now and this is this is the water. The green is the land you need to stay away from. You lose a life if you crash into the land or you collect uh, a wrong number. And in this case, the, the wrong number would be an even number. So I'm going to try to stay away from uh, this one for sure and any other even numbers. But uh, I'm going to try to pick this one up. So I'm going to go ahead and click it, the screen to start the game, and we'll be playing. And it's not too bad. I see 26 up there, which I also want to stay over. Now, I'm trying to look for, look around for uh, odd numbers. I can't see what that one is down there, but that's an even number. There's even. So we're just going to cruise around, and there's 25. I'm going to go ahead and pick that up. And you can see the meter down here filling up. It looks like I've got uh, 
Maybe three to more to get. There's an even number. And the other levels will have different objects on it. Uh, that, such as uh, direction changers, teleporters, axes to chop logs that may block your way. And people are always asking, well, why does he need uh, an axe? Well, I always tell them, Otto is an otter. He's not a beaver. So he, yes, he does need an axe to get through, uh, get rid of logs. Okay, so there's that 11. This should finish up the level. You'll see it fill up. And we go on to level two, and now I need to get even numbers. So I'll show you some of the maybe some teleporters I'll come across and uh, direction changers. We'll try to show you that. Let's see if there's any. Let's go down here, and also I need to show you how you can go from screen to screen. Actually, I can't avoid that. So there, I lost a life there, but. Go on. That's how that works. I kind of went. When you go off the map, you'll just show up on the other side. Let's go ahead and get that even number. And I'm going to need to get out of this. It looks like there's no way out, but actually, you'll just take me over the other side. Wrap a wrap around. Now there's a direction changer, and I it made me go right, and it changed colors. And there I went a different way. So if I hit it now, it'll go back to moving left. You gotta see how that works. Let's go ahead and get that 22 in there. And that's a tight fit, but easy level is not too bad. Let's go ahead. Uh, I need to show you. Hopefully, I can f show you where a teleporter is. And then, excuse me, hit the microphone there accidentally. And I think there's an axe over here somewhere. Let's see. Maybe up here. Nope. Maybe thinking of a different level. But anyways, you'll you'll identify the uh, be be able to identify the axe because it has a brown handle and the red uh, red blade. There's twelve. Let's click it real fast. There's another even number. Okay. Uh, now this level does have teleporters, I believe. I need to get even numbers, so let's go ahead and... Actually, I'm not going to pay too much attention to getting the numbers. I'll show you what the... There's a... I think a teleporter down in here. Yeah, that, uh, that's a direction changer. Let's go ahead and go up here. There's a teleporter. Let's go ahead and see if we can hit that. I'm going to have to turn pretty quick in here. Okay. Put me to a different part of the map. And there is the axe. And I'm not certain. You In the game you'll hear a little chopping noise. And it's, it's removed a uh, log somewhere on the screen. I'm, we're not seeing one of the logs. But I think there's still one. Let's see if I can show you what that looks like but you don't want to run into the log or anything like uh, land there's a log and there's an axe and I suspect that let's see if this axe actually gets rid of that particular log yep and there it goes so that's how that works and then when I crash go ahead and it take, took away life it goes back over the whole way that shows you where you went and bring you right back to the start. And you notice you can start again. And, and I still have two lives left. And it didn't take away all the uh, progress I made. So that's that's pretty cool. I've got to, I get to start again. But it doesn't take away all the, the even numbers that I got. So it looks like I need to get two or three on this level. And I have completed the level. So that's pretty much how you play. Um, I've shown you all the... Uh, little extra obstacles and stuff like that and if you really like playing this game be sure and check out the rounding game which we also have uh, which is a lot of fun and plays very similar to this except you look for rounding numbers and when you get through playing math games be sure and check out the left turn auto which is a logic is a great logic puzzle game and it plays just like this and you have more options and it's free to play online or on your Apple or Android devices I hope you enjoy playing the game I hope this video has helped some, and thanks for watching.